Good day and welcome to the uh, September 2015 Birch Box Canada. Uh, my name is Lori and uh, this will be my very first review of Birch Box as it is my very first Birch Box. Uh, from, I signed up uh, via referral link of a friend of mine, Ashley's, and uh, as I understand it, um, Birchbox is slightly different in the US and the UK. Uh, it is one of the premier um, beauty subscription services. I actually was at a Birchbox shop in New York City, which was very, very cool. Um, and so I was a bit intrigued and decided to uh, subscribe and try it out. I did have a bit of a hiccup uh, with this very first month. Um, Birchbox sent, dutifully sent me the um, tracking code for my box, but my box just never showed up and never showed up. And when I looked at the tracking code, it was a bit odd. Um, but I have to commend their customer service. When I contacted them and asked some questions, they uh, discovered that there was, a, again, a bit of a hiccup and um, issued the box immediately and then offered uh, in compensation for my... Um, inconvenience to cover the cost of the October um, birch box. Uh, costs for Canadians will be in the description box below, um, but I believe it is $10 a month plus shipping, but I could very well be wrong. So as you can tell, I've opened up the outer box for the birch box and inside is a really um, sweet uh, box uh, from the months that I've looked at of previous um each month is a uh the actual physical box container it is themed differently and design has a different design so that's uh, actually quite sweet so <clears throat> inside once you crack open the box and i'll just lay that there so and drop it there so it looks all pretty and shit um first things you see and i haven't looked at anyone's birch box um to date, uh, just because I wanted to be surprised. So the first thing is a couple of cards. First thing um, is uh, a 20% off coupon for buying um, some items at the Birch Box shop. And then the second card is the, hi there, uh, a little bit about the box. And on the back is um, the items that should be contained in the box. So we'll go through those. Um, so I don't know if you can see there and I'll try to, um, zoom in, pardon the hand. Uh, the design is inspired by Birchbox subscribers, Debbie Savage, Sarah Gradier, and Angela Coppola. So well done. Um, quite a lovely box. So carefully tucked within the pink, um, Tissue paper are a couple of items, and by the box, it says I should have five items. The first thing is uh, Brio Geo, and I think, oh, look, two um, Brio Geo uh, Ginseng and Biotin Volumizer Volumizing Blow Dry Spray. Um, each of these are one ounce or 30 milliliters and uh, I'm just going to pop the top off and have a little sniff and holy smokes that's gorgeous so um yeah I could totally go around with that stuff scent squeaking out of my head so that's fantastic um, next item is the Cynthia Rowley liquid eyeliner so uh, again, pardon my struggle with opening packages um, and doing the banner with one hand, but there you go. Uh, so liquid eyeliner, um, one milliliter or uh, 0.034 fluid ounces. A full size of this is $21. And my expectation and my experience with previous liquid eyeliners is that this is likely a full size. So, um, and the color is cobalt, which, um, is blue. And, uh, 
that's pretty neat. I don't necessarily wear a lot of colored liquid eyeliners, uh, but uh, you know what? I'm not adverse. Um, I adore liquid eyeliners um, in a pen form, especially. Uh, the tip of this looks quite long and fine, and I am just going to swatch it. So excuse me for one second. And I'm just going to show you my other hand. Um, so that is a swatch of the blue color, which is very intense and I'm very intrigued. Not that I would likely wear it, um, every day to work, but I could certainly see myself splashing out a little bit and trying it on the weekend and that. So that is pretty nice. So inside the box, so let's moving on. So that was the Cynthia Rowley Beauty Liquid Liner in Cobalt. And moving along, there should be another couple of items within this little cardboard container and indeed there are and I'm just going to dump them in here so inside um, I have a uh, pop beauty uh, trio of eyeshadow and this is a pop portfolio eyeshadow trio uh, themed sugar plum full size $26 which my um, expectation is that this is the full size so great value um, and I don't know if you can tell that there is a um, like a shimmery white and a shimmery plum and a shimmery silver. Um, I probably won't take it out of the packet uh, right at the moment because um, I may or may not give it to my niece who loves eyeshadow. Um, but for me, the colors are quite lovely and God only knows I might keep it for myself. There you go. So then the other item is 100% pure uh coffee bean caffeine eye cream and this is 100% natural 100% vegan for dark circles and puffiness and the amount in this container is um, 0.3 fluid ounces or 8 milliliters. A full size, of which I don't believe this is, is uh, $26. But uh, nonetheless, I must say, uh, especially after this week, I have dark circles and I have a shit ton of puffiness. So there you go. Um, let me just go and... That is it. So... Um, the card though and i'll just show it to you so we have just to recap we have the pop beauty eyeshadow trio the coffee bean caffeine eye cream the cynthia rowley uh liquid eyeliner and cobalt um we have two um brio geo blossom ginseng and biotin volumizer um blow dry spray um so that's uh five items and this list uh indicates 100 percent pure so the coffee coffee bean caffeine eye cream the volumizing blow dry spray the liquid liner the eyeshadow trio however it appears that the toca toca crema de mano full uh is not within this box so i'm not sure if they ran out and decided to give me a extra brio geo um which is fine um that's okay i'm not gonna like lose any sleep over it but i will probably um just send them a quick email just to clarify that uh, they opted to send me an alternate item because they ran out of the crema de mano um, so there you go that's my um selection of items for the september 2015 uh, birch box uh, all in all a pretty good uh starting point and uh, I look forward to future boxes from Birchbox. So if you have any questions or you want to um, let me know what you received in your Birchbox, I'd very much appreciate it uh, hearing about it in the comments below. And thank you very much for sticking with me. I'm still relatively new to the whole um, beauty subscription review unboxing challenges and technology. So um, thanks very much for tuning in and we'll see you with the next box. Cheers.